So here's what happens when you uh, take a wrong turn. You have to climb up that from over there. The trail was actually supposed to go that way, I think. But somehow I ended up taking it all the way down and had to come up this cliff. Uh, made me start thinking about what happens when we make a decision outside of what God has for us and what he's called us to do. And um, the more I thought about it, the more I started thinking about how important it is that we learn to hear the Holy Spirit and his promptings and his direction for us. And uh, sometimes it's really not easy, especially when you're you're wondering about what God's doing and why he's doing it. And uh, it's easy to to get scared and have a hard time hearing what he's saying. But if you'll find a quiet place and you'll get into the word and begin to read the word, because the Bible says that when we get into the word, his will becomes known to us. Uh, scripture, scripture reference is coming. Um, but uh, seriously, the word will guide you and it will carry you. And the Holy Spirit will use it and prompt you and remind you what the word says as well as specific situations he'll speak to you and he'll guide you and he'll direct you and uh the more i get to know holy spirit the more in love i am with him and the less i do that you know those rocks i wasn't really prepared to do that climbing but i'll tell you god uses everything in our lives to bring us closer to him he uses everything that that he he has everything we go through the bible says that He'll never leave us nor forsake us. He says he's faithful and just to finish the work that he's begun in us. He says that all situations, all situations, he works them out to our good because we love him, because we go after him, because we pursue him. You know, uh, tomorrow night I'm going to be speaking at First Methodist Church here in Casper, Wyoming. And, you know, my goal isn't so they can hear me, so I can speak eloquently but it's that I might demonstrate the power of God, that I might allow him to work through me in such a way that people's lives are transformed. You know, the Bible says that faith working through love, do you understand that <clears throat> when love so permeates us and it ignites faith, we see signs, miracles, and wonders, we see people's lives transformed forever. And I'm just, you know, if you're in the Casper area, find yourself there, I believe God's gonna meet you. Have a great day.